in their respective gyms. Bill Covington Jr., Ron Groover, Ted Valentine, the officials, and we're underway with the Seminoles. They go inside to Koprovica. He kicks it back out. Still 10 on the shot clock, and now a turnover. In transition, Usher lays it up and in, and the Jackets strike first. Jose Alvarado is an absolute marvel. That, that steal he just made, if you show him the ball, if he gets a glimpse of it, beautiful pass. My goodness. I think they've got a, they cannot overhelp. You know, you've got to stick with people and, and make the ball handler finish a play. Tenor Engam in off the bench, misses the shot. Raekwon Gray with a putback, and the Seminoles on the board. Up the offensive glass for Raekwon Gray. Michael DeVoe, who scored 40 points in the two games against Florida State this year with a tough turnaround. And you can't do that. Just make him shoot over you. Don't give him an angle to the basket. Easier said than done, obviously, but you're going to have to do some hard things to win this game. Anthony Polite for three. A one-point lead in the early going for the Yellow Jackets here in the ACC Championship game. Alvarado. Really tough, too, instead of that. Baseline jumper for Malik Osborne not there. Koprovica back into the game. Coming off a great night last night against the Tar Heels and a tip back up and in. Alternate angle of tonight's game, the New York Life Above the Rim game. Streaming live on the ESPN app. Perfectly timed to be above the rim. The championship game between Florida State and Georgia Tech. Dan Schulman, Jay Billis, Allison Williams. Very glad you're with us here with the Greensboro Coliseum as Kopravica lays it in and ups the lead to four. Can't play drive and kick on you. Look at the size on the floor for Florida State at all five positions right now. Georgia Tech in transition. And right on the follow. 18 turnovers against North Carolina. They had 21 turnovers against Georgia Tech in Atlanta. Raekwon Gray with a soft touch from the baseline. Turned into a, a, an outstanding player in every aspect of the game. Redshirt Jr. named third team all ACC. Boy, Usher passed up a good look, but maybe he knew that Khalid Moore was due to knock one down. Be a problem. And as long as you can field the team with five players, you can play. It's really impressive uh, defensively. And it worked well enough for them to have a 16-8 and record this year. Oh, what a block. My goodness. That is a big-time block from behind by Balsha Koprovica. That was a big-time block. Yeah, he's definitely hurt. He's still holding it. Good one. Right inside. Nice two-man game with DeVoe. That's who Josh Pastner is. Like, that's not an act. He's, every single time I've ever talked with him, and I'm sure you would say the same thing, Jay, and the glass is half full. The glass is overflowing. Yeah, he's a great guy, but my thing would be, if life is so short, why such a long message? <laughs> <laughs> and he says, if you leave a message clearly, you know, a guy who uh, walked on at Arizona, always wanted to be a coach, back to the time when he was a kid, uh, was an assistant uh, initially under Lou Olson at Arizona, eventually uh, went to Memphis, 50-foot pass to a teammate for a dunk. That was the... Uh, you know, the dagger at, at the end of the game, the big bucket they needed. Parham a good look, and they needed that. A three for Bubba Parham to get it back within one. The Tech got away with a walk on that DeVoe drive in the middle. Florida State with yet another turnover, and you cannot guard that. You cannot guard a run out. These turnovers are killing Florida State. 50% from three, and 100% from the free throw line. And they're down. Yeah. And it's the turnovers. 11 turnovers have led to 12 points, and you give DeVoe enough opportunities to drive in a kick. Parham a deep one. And he runs it down. An uncontested offensive rebound for a 5'10 guy, and he lays it back in. Basketball is a game of rhythm. Establish yours, disrupt theirs. And a big bucket for Florida State as MJ Walker, the senior, knocks down a three. That's an, that's an example, Dan, of overhelping that I've been talking about. You know, Polite didn't need to go in there and do that. How about Scotty Barnes leaning in? The sense may be fortunate to be tied. Another, Another one. one. Wow. Alvarado for three. I mean, you need a security guard to handle the ball when you're around Jose Alvarado. Conditioning, it made my reflexes quicker. I asked him if he ever got out there and sparred with his, sparred with his dad, though. He said, yeah, one time he hit me, never again. <laughs> Close as it was expected to be between these two. DeVoe, the lefty, saw touch up and in, and Tech will take a one-point lead into halftime.
you know, that, that if you have the, the guts to tackle yeah. Earl Campbell, it's going to hurt you more. It's going to hurt him. Look him up, kids. Go to the Google and click on videos, <laughs> and you'll see Earl Campbell. Championship, that was in 2012. Michael Snare was the MVP. Georgia Tech, you got to go back a ways. They've been in the league longer. They've won three. 1985, 1990, just great teams. Well, their teams in the mid-80s, uh, uh, with all respect to Lethal Weapon 3, I don't think there are any teams better now. Ooh, what a drive. Nobody picked them up. The clock is at 8. Evans trying to penetrate. Kopravica lays it in. Boys. He's got a lot of game, and he's getting better and better. DeVoe with a drive. And lays it in. The lefty gets it done with a right hand. Still try to size up this defense that's, as Jay said, starts as a 1-3-1, then it looks like a 2-3. Boy, Koprovica's getting after it, isn't he? Well, the ball's moving, and then he's doing a good job in the championship game. I don't know what's gotten into Patrick Ewing's guys. Maybe it was that, you know, when the security guards at Madison Square Garden didn't know who he was. Well, you can say it to people anyway, but if you win it, it's true. <laughs> So you say it to them, but if you lost, you say, no, don't look at it. My goodness. This is a different Florida State team here in the second half. Here's at Ryerson University in Toronto has decided he would like, remember, this is a free year for everybody. He's coming back next year. Both he and Nathaniel Jack have said they want to come back for a fifth year. Moses Wright making a point for the Jackets. This sort of bailed him out with that foul. Usher, nicely done. It was a good cut. He caught the ball on the move. Barnes trying to back down Alvarado and turns it over. DeVoe, nice little change of pace to the Jackets. Yeah, it looked like they were socially distancing, but they were also littering. <laughs> oh, Scotty Barnes getting on the glass. Sturdivant, who has played sparingly off the bench, a nice find to Alvarado. Kicks it out to Usher for three. Yes! That's the overhelp. I would think that's a good reference. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's another steal. Wow. My goodness. That is ridiculously good. Usher ahead to Alvarado. More defense into offense. First coaching job. Bill Self. Right. And he didn't have Koprovica on him, took advantage of the matchup and gives Tech the lead. Job by DeVoe to play off at two feet. Came to a two-footed jump stop. Wow, how about that finish? MJ Walker ties it up. That was just strength and athleticism. Everything's going on in the world, we all understand that. But hopefully these, these have been, you know, a little bit of a distraction and a diversion. Now heading into a fun time of year at the NCAA tournament. And, you know, speaking on behalf of all of us announcers. I've always thought that our colleagues did a great job and an amazing job. But their job has become ten times harder. And they do it with the, the same professionalism. It's, yeah. it's amazing what they've accomplished. 10, 15 years ago. Now that now that's a good job. Barnes using the Osborne screen lays it in, and it's a one-point game. Georgia Tech getting a little spread out. For the Yellow Jackets, a trio of Seminoles have three, including Gray. Nobody's got four in the game. So Dark Calhoun guarding Alvarado. Good back cut. That's just beautiful. My goodness. Sturdivant to Alvarado, and the lead is four. Have a team full of guys that can make plays. Wide open look, Walker. Yes. That is not going to end well. No, that's not the way Florida State's going to look at it, but I don't think it's a coincidence that they had 21 last time. They got 24 now. What a strong drive and finish by the player of the year in the ACC, Moses Wright. Florida State decided they were going to deny everybody else, and then Moses Wright made the winning move on that. It's a great play. Walker, no. Rebound to Barnes, and it's 6-9. He easily lays it back in. Well, he kept it high in Los Angeles. Played in the same backcourt with Ralph Jackson. Sturdivant getting some crunch the time pass. minutes. So, yeah, great drive and dish. Oh! Oh, what a finish! Deep corner. Sturdivant shot fake. And goes right, but you talk about attacking a closeout. And that's over Raekwon Gray. My goodness. Oh, they don't make posters anymore, but that would make a good one. That's more an Instagram. Yeah. And all his teammates on the bench, they were up and jumping even oh. before he slammed it home.
They knew what was coming. I think there's more littering in McCamish going on right now. <laughs> and above the rim finish. Just beautiful. Polite with the answer at the other end, but what a moment for Jordan Usher. Barnes, tough shot. But Ravica blocked. Polite lays it in. Timeout, Florida State. Right, Kevin, thank you. Florida State with a lay-in by Scotty Barnes. Those ridiculous numbers down the stretch. If you're tech now, you just don't want to foul. Make sure the clock keeps running. If you can, I don't think Georgia Tech should come off of a three-point shooter. Force the drive. If you give up a two, fine. Barnes for three. One possession game. Already gave him the player of the game, and he's he keeps proving it. Right. Oh, look what he did. <laughs> How fitting is that? Georgia Tech has won the ACC championship. Georgia Tech team, they earned every bit of this tonight.